Good morning students. Today I will discuss with you career aspects of physical education. Career aspects of physical education. Okay. So today's discussion sports authority of India. I mean shy sports authority of India. So shy means sports authority of India. Okay. So now I'll discuss with you what are the objects and functions of sports authority of India. So look students, objectives and functions means to conduct coaching camps and assist the national terms for participation in international competition. So first objectives and functions of sports authority of India to conduct coaching and assist the national teams for participation in international competition and another important functions and objectives of sports authority of India to implement and monitor the sports promotional schemes of shy i mean sports authority of india and state government in in eastern region of india so to conduct diploma course in coaching and certificate course for various sports and games understood and another important functions and objectives of sports authority of india what to raise the technical competence and knowledge of coaches by conducting refresher and skill development courses. Understood. And another thing to assist and conduct refresher courses of, for coaches and physical education teachers of eastern and northeastern states. So to provide organizational support, documentations and sports science information with a view to achieve excellence in sports. Okay, and another important uh, functions and objectives of Sports Authority of India to identify sports talent among various ages groups and groom them for sports excellence. These are all about Sports Authority of India. Understood? I mean, shy. These are all objectives and functions. So, next, another important question what differentiate between an amateur and professional sports person what differentiate differentiate an amateur and professional sports person So differentiate an amateur and professional sports person. So what to provide scientific backup? What to provide scientific back uh, scientific backup? Uh, so, I mean uh, scientific backup to sports person to achieve a high level performance in sports professional athletes. What look to provide scientific to Provide scientific backup to sports person to achieve high level performance in sports professional athletes are paid a huge amount. Understood? Those who are sports professional athletes are paid huge amount. While amateur athletes are not usually paid at all. Understood? So, sports, uh, those who are uh, professional sports person, they are paid a huge amount for play. And while amateur athletes uh, are not usually paid at all. So amateur athletes are more like birdies joining an adult hockey league just to play. So college players are technically amateur athletes as well because they are playing the game with no financial reward. Understood? So college players are technically amateur athletes as well because they are playing the game with no financial rewards understood so this this is a uh, differentiate between differentiate between 
an amateur and professional sports person. So I have already discussed with you shy I mean sports authority of India and another important question I have just discussed with you what uh, differentiate between an amateur and professional sports person. Now I will discuss with you details about IOA. I mean function functions of IOA. I mean Indian Olympic Association. What? So look students, IOA, I mean Indian Olympic Association stands for the Indian Olympic Association. I mean it is the main institution for coordinating the selection of athletes for the Olympic Games. So what? IOA institution for the coordinating the selection of athletes for the game of Olympics and it consists of what general secretary general secretary president okay general secretary president and executive general executive general okay so look its main functions i mean uh, IOA's main functions uh, what it promotes the Olympic Games each and every level thereby developing it as an amateur sports but look its functions means its main objects the it promotes the Olympic Games at each and every level thereby developing it as an amateur sports and Another important thing, it selects athletes to represent India at Olympic Games. Understood? And it also selects athletes to represent Indian at ASEAN Games and other international games also. Not only Olympic Games, these are also selected for ASEAN Games and international other games. Okay? And look, another important matter, it is uh, responsible for managing and coordinating the Indian teams for any such events understood and another important thing it provides sponsorships to the players and moreover it also selects the athletes for representing country at the uh, prestigious common world games as well and lastly IOA forms the main force behind managing and selecting athletes for various games and events. So, understood students, functions mention the main functions of IOA. There are main functions, uh, means it promotes the Olympic Games at each and every level, thereby developing it is an amateur sports. Second one, it selects athletes to represent at India at Olympic Games. Not only Olympic Games, it is responsible for present India, represent Indian at Asian Games and other international games also. And it is responsible for managing and coordinating the Indian teams for any such events. And it provides sponsorships to the player and moreover, it also selects the athletes to representing country at the prestigious Commonwealth Games as well. And thus, IOA, I mean Indian Olympic Association, forms the main force behind managing and selecting athletes for various games and events. So, next, another important question. What Panchayati Raj? What? Panchayati Raj, I mean Panchayat Yuva Kendra or Khelo Vijan. Panchayati Yuva Kendra, I mean PYKKA. PYKKA. Panchayati Yuva Kendra and Khel Avijan. Okay. So look, student, Panchayati Yuva Kendra and Khel Avijan mean the Panchayat Yuva Kendra and or Khel Avijan, I mean PYKKA. A aims to encourage the promote sports and games among ruler uh, youth by providing them with access uh, to basic sports infrastructure and equipment at the panchayat level and opportunity to particip participate in sports competitions 
at the block and district level understand leading to further opportunities for talented sponsorship energizing from the this process to receive advanced training and exposure and participate and excel in state and after that national and international tournaments also the state of meghalaya like look the state of meghalaya has from pykka i mean panchayat yuva kendra and or khel ofijan okay so meghalaya has from pykka sales and constituted pykk committees with the chief secretaries as chairperson so sports department in state have also been strengthened to implement the scheme look in meghalaya district sports officer have been engaged to implement the scheme at the grassroots level understood and dso's the they are for responsible for implementations of the scheme in village or block panchayats with the help of implementations agencies understood like the sports uh, or youth clubs of nehru yuva kendra and schools and in addition to lead the scheme at the village uh, level the provision as uh, has been made for the appointment to the uh, kridishari a sports volunteer in each village and the scheme is being implemented in the state wide notifications understood so these are all about panchayat yuva kendra or khel obhijan understood the grand under panchayat yuva kendra or khel obhijan includes one type capital grant for infrastructure development annual operational grant maintenance of infrastructure and honorarium to kiridashri and annual uh, acquisitions uh, grant the procurement uh, of sports materials competition grant or grant for conduct of block level and district level and state level tournaments also understood so these are all about panchayat पंचायत युवा केंद्र और खेल अभिजान ओके सो दिस आर ऑल फॉर टू डेज थैंक यू स्टूडेंट्स केयरफुली लिसन माय वॉयस एंड स्टडी एट योर होम ओके Thank you.